first video ever. I am Berry Moo. You can find me on Instagram right here. Despite being a full-time artist for a little while now, I have never actually had physical copy of my art. And on Lunar New Year, I printed out some of my illustrations to write like little wishes and send out to friends. And I honestly fell in love. It's hit different. Uh, it's filled me with so much joy, just, just that little colorful, vibrant print. So I decided to open a shop to share this joy with many more people, I hope. <laughs> the process of prepping for a shop launch is so daunting and overwhelming and I kind of scared. So I decided to bring you on this journey with me. Mm, so I'm not alone anymore. <laughs> Uh, let's go! I encounter my first speed bump. Uh, when I started making this design, I didn't really have a solid plan, but rather just jumping right in. So now that all the sticker sheets are done and I put them together, I realized that the first one, the, the pink one right here that I did, it really didn't fit with the others at all. That means I'm gonna have to redo this. I really like the design of it though, so I will use the sketch of it and turn it into a post on my Instagram. some new art book uh, let me show you what I got so I got this from Japanese creative bookstore I'll leave the link down below if you want to check it out the first one is from Yoriyuki Ikigami I'll leave their Instagram link right here let me show you a spread like look at this the colors and the brush stroke and the composition everything is just so nice and this is the current from Heitsuke Kitazawa and their work is 
also so so breathtaking uh like look at this the colors the pattern it's 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 incredible <laughs> i'm so happy with these two books do you have a favorite art book that you would like to share i would love to hear it
so excited for this because now I can finally use the good tripod this is the tripod I've been using for the past few days and it's so sacrilegious now I can finally use this one it's a good one from my boyfriend it's so much studier I'm excited my pink sticker sheet is almost done I have the stickers ready and I merge everything down now I have to make the bleed first I'm gonna duplicate the stickers layer I have it isolated from the background then I go to Gaussian blur and I'll do it around like 10 to 11 percent 11 just to be safe and then I duplicate and merge and keep doing that until it is opaque this will be the color layers of the bleed when it's opaque you can see here there's a lot of artifacts and we're gonna fix it in photoshop uh, now i'm gonna send it to my photoshop unfortunately you do need a desktop and photoshop for this part i'm sorry i don't know any other way because i use desktop for my main job and it's what i'm fluent in now i duplicate the sticker layers again and use the minimum filter and i'll use 25 pixel for an a5 sheets as you can see it's uh, created a really crisp line around it but the color is darker so that's why we need the base color and I'll flipping mask it onto it and ta-da just place the order for my sticker sheets <laughs> I'm so worried I hope it's okay
joining this journey with me and staying until the end. I really appreciate it. Do you have any thoughts on the journey so far? Please leave your comment down below or just say hi because I would like to make more art friends. Uh, thank you so much again and see you next time.